This podcast is proud to be part of the TalkSport Fan Network. TalkSport. Powered by fans. Danilo's free. And he goes to get one. Danilo! First time we've seen them attack them. And there's Brandon! Well, that's what I've wanted to see Robinson do. Tyler Wadi! Hello, welcome back to this edition of Red Side of the Trent. As you can see from the title, it's our end of year quiz. And I'm delighted to be joined by Reese Lane and Christian Brown. Unfortunately, no Lee Clark due to work commitments and holiday planning. As uh, as, as we record this, uh, we play our charity game on uh, the Saturday, the same day as the Champions League, 1st of June. This will go out on the Sunday as we record this. Uh, so hopefully everyone enjoys the Champions League and can enjoy the quiz on a Sunday and get involved. Um so the the idea is I, I've done a series of questions, five questions that are based around the Premier League. Christian and Reese have done uh, some round uh, Forest for, for everyone who's obviously tuned in to listen to a Forest podcast for some strange reason. Um, but we'll get right into it, chaps. Um, but before before we do, I just want to see if, if you're both OK. You're both looking to the, forward to the game as we record this? <laughs> That's been full time tomorrow. We got we got spanked last year, and I feel yeah. like we've made the teams a lot more even this and, and time. The, all the weather's like halved as well, so that gives us a, a big yeah. advantage, I think. Yeah, <laughs> boots aren't going to be bloody like burning as we walk off the yeah. pitch. We start to like, was, absolutely was warm last year. Um, I, I, obviously, Lee, Lee being absent, he was meant to do some like quotes like he did last season from pundits and whatnot. But so so that that kind of gone out the window, unfortunately. But let's get right into it. So I'm doing the Premier League stuff uh, to begin with. My first question, uh, I did this last year, actually, it re- revolved around hat tricks. Right. Uh, but I would like you both to name five of the 12 players to score hat tricks this season. A point for each uh, for those playing at home. Five of the 12 players that have scored a hat trick this season. We all know at least one or two, actually. <laughs> Let me know when you've uh, you've got something written down. I've got guys. four. I'm just trying Ooh, to think. I've got four. More. Yeah. I'm trying to think. This yeah. seems like quite a lot of people to score hat tricks this season. Yeah, I've got I've got five. Okay. So I'm good. Uh... Right. I'm not even going to think about it anymore. <laughs> yeah, I've got five. Yeah, just remembered. Cool. Right. As uh, as three and, and Lee, of course, and probably many others are massive fans of Premier League here. So hopefully you'll be able to delve into the vault guys with this one. But this is the first season in Premier League history that all three promoted sides have been relega- relegated after one season since the 99, uh, 1997 season, 98 season. Who were those three sides that got relegated? Point for each. Can you can you say the question again? So in, this is the first season where all three promoted sides have been relegated since the since, 97-98 yeah. season. Who were the three sides that got relegated in the 97-98 season? I did word that terribly. Um, yeah, that's what I was about. 97-98. I will give you a clue. But yeah, one of those teams is currently a Premier League side. So that's the se- So we that season, them three went down. We came up as champions. It was yeah, yeah. So I'm trying to think. Great soundtrack on FIFA '98 for those who who had that game. Blur song too, I believe. Rockefeller Skank '99. <laughs> oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so uh, two of the sides are currently in League One. If you want to, if you want an extra clue, one side Ooh. currently in the Premier League. Uh, well, the, that rules one of mine out. out <laughs> uh, I shouldn't give you too many clues, but I, I feel like there's a lot of I've got blank two. stairs. Okay, I'm, I'm, well, that, I'm that, yeah, that I'm I've now got two. Season, definitely yeah. happy with two. Right. Um, yeah, I've gone. I've got. I've got three. 
Last season yeah, saw that. saw a huge turnover in managers. How many managers lost their jobs this season, though? And I'll give you a bonus point if you can name each of them as well. And we all know one at one least. Or all, all, all like. one point per manager, or all of them. One point per. Are manager. we counting ones that? So are we counting ones that have announced they're leaving, or ones that have actually? No, ones that got like s- the sacked or like Lopetegui don't count. He walked out. Okay. No, but what I'm thinking is like, are we counting deserved? Yeah, like like David got... Moyes and that. No, 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 no. Yeah, because they no. also during the season. the season rather than yeah. so someone who's actually got the bullet during, during basically. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Uh... Quite a tough one because last season there was I think there was like 13 managers that had a turnover. I think ter- yeah, two quite, teams obviously sat their, their managers off, twice. Yeah. Like Leeds and Everton sacked managers twice, I think. Or was it Leeds? Was it Leeds and Sorry. Chelsea? It might have been Chelsea. This might be a contention box. Obviously, it might be an answer. Um, actually, I'll, I'll private chat you it quickly. But like, <laughs> yes, I don't, mind. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't. I don't mind if Reece sees this. It's okay. Just because Great um, I'm going to try and not. See, I'll, I'll try and not see it. No, that's right. You can. I mean, this is for Adam. Uh, no, yeah, let's be fair. No, I'd say no. Because that's you know, going to be during the season. Okay, cool. Yeah, during the season. Cool. Okay. Um, there wasn't many. Uh, no, there was not. That's why that was a good question, I thought. Right. Question four. Uh, massive VAR controversy <laughs> in the Tottenham Hotspurs and Liverpool game this season. Who scored the disallowed goal that should not have been disallowed? It should, because it was for Liverpool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'll all get that one. Yeah, it's pretty comfortable, that one. I think, I think I'm doing well here. Right. Okay. And then my last question, it's a point for each of these. Uh, which two Chelsea players had a argument over a penalty in their win versus Everton? Who didn't? Yeah. <laughs> really not, question. Can't. Who didn't? I'm guessing you're not counting Cole Palmer as one. No, no, no. No, the two players. Are we who counting were... the ones who are pulling players away? No, it's no, just, just the two, the two out. main culprits, the two, two main, main culprits. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fine. Say, Am I running through the answers one. immediately, or wait until the end, guys? Uh, go to the end. That's it. Per round. Good. Yeah. Do you want to do it per round? Go on, do it per round then. Okay, right. So from the top, right. Five players out of twelve to have scored hat tricks this season. Christian, I'll let you give. Uh, your answers first. So I went for Palmer, Jackson, Wood, Solanke, and Ali Bio. Yes. So I've got three of them. Yeah. Uh, Phil Foden. Yep, he got two this season. Um, Eddie and Katia. Uh, no. No. No, Eddie and Katia. I thought it was last season. Against... Patrick, I think. I thought it was against Sheffield United this season. No. He did not. Yeah, everyone he else got that. Less. I wouldn't blame you for that. <laughs> um, so, unless I'm, I, unless I'm, my information is completely wrong, but I'm uh, going gonna, gonna to check it up because I, I watched the program yesterday. And yeah, that's he, how I knew uh, it. Adam, you, he, he's right. He did. Yeah. Oh, he did. All oh, right. right. I'm so, oh, it, was, so it was it I'm was so a so net, netbusters program, and he oh. scored a scream against Sheffield, and he's like, "That's his first ever." Arsenal oh, against it was at, at home, wasn't it? Oh yeah. God, I completely missed it. Otherwise, I never got it. I do apologise. Five out of 13 yeah. then. All right, so the full list is uh, Phil Foding, Erlen Haaland, Ollie Watkins, Dom Solanke, Chris Wood, Cole Palmer, John Philippe Mateta, Adebayo, <laughs> Jarrod Bowen, Mateus Cunha, Sung Hyun Min, Nicholas Jackson, and as as you've corrected me, Reese, Eddie and Ketia. Who did Adebayo get his actually against? Uh, I believe Brighton. I remember him getting hit Luton. God. Yeah, against Brighton. You remember when like, yeah. four up inside like half hour? So it's stupid. Yeah, yeah, I remember. Yeah, that. yeah. yeah. Uh, so this is the first season in Premier League history that all three promoted sides have been relegated after one season since the 97-98 uh, season. Uh, Reese, who did you put down? Bolton. Yeah, that's one. Barnsley. Yeah, that's another. Wimbledon. No. Oh. Christian, I have you got the for... other one? I went for Bolton. Yeah. Uh, Charlton, which is obviously wrong because obviously Barnsley. Yeah, yeah, that's wrong. And... Uh, Palace. Yeah, Palace is the oh. one that he was missing. Charlton won the playoffs. Between, between us, we got the three. Between us, we got the three. Yeah. 
they, that was the final once that famous final Charlton Sunderland. Yes, it was on penalties, wasn't it? I believe. Yeah. Uh, so, how many managers lost their jobs this season, chaps? Christian, I went for three. Go for you. Three, three is three. Three is correct. So, for yeah. a bonus point on each of these, can you name all three managers? I think one of them is a little contentious, actually. But we'll go. For I it. went for Cooper, Peckingbottom, yeah. and Hodgson. Yeah, Same correct. More. Yeah, correct. Yeah. Correct on all four fronts. I think you all got this one. Uh, who scored the disallowed goal that should have stood between Spurs and Liverpool? Luis Diaz. Yeah, Lewis, Lewis Diaz. Diaz yeah. Um, and then which two players had an argument over a penalty in their win versus Everton? Madueke and Jackson. Yeah, Madueke. Yeah. Jackson. yeah, 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 yeah. I all think right. you pretty much got almost a full house other than yeah. Pam. The just relegation both, stats. Yeah. yeah, we just both got one wrong on that. So. Full of football exactly. knowledge, guys. Yeah. So bad. was it a bonus point for getting so for, for getting the managers' names, or was it for getting? Yeah, them? yeah, yeah. Yes. Bonus for <laughs> each. So we either got one, so two, one for three, each. four, five, six, seven, yeah, yeah, eight, eleven. So we either got fourteen out of fifteen. Then I believe. Wowzers! Oh, Wowzers! Unbelievable scenes. Right. Okay. Great stuff. Pretty Wimbledon. <laughs> right. right okay, who's so... going first? Christian. Christian first. Yeah, we'll move on to Forest Matters. Um, <laughs> just checking. I'm coming through. Okay. Have you seen that little Wi-Fi symbol pop up? So no, yeah, just, your screen's a little bit blurry on mine. Uh, that, I don't mind. I'd rather you have a good audio. Yeah, yeah, yeah so you can yeah, we can deal with that. <laughs> so, uh, Nottingham Forest progressed to the fifth round of the FA Cup this season when they beat Bristol City, uh, and they won on penalties. Of course, who scored the Forest penalties that day? <laughs> that's one of my <laughs> questions. That would be then, mate, because that's one of my. <laughs> Oh, that's why so I know exactly. <laughs> so I know exactly yeah. who scored him. So I'm glad I've got a backup one there. So yeah, one point for each name. <laughs> I'm gonna really struggle because I. Uh, I feel like yeah, it's a bit of an unfair advantage here, but. <laughs> um, God, who would have took penalties in this game? I really don't know, to be honest. Who's, who's who was playing for us? Saying that, I'm trying yeah, to think. Pretty one strong who did team, take, to be yeah. fair. Yeah, but like if you if, uh, look at who actually took the penalties, they're, they're all like players who the... expect to be starting. I knew who scored the winner. Um, God, this is a low point, isn't it? <laughs> it is. It really is. It's a low point. Um, we have to speed up a little. Give you, give you ten more seconds, Adam, before I have to move on. Oh no, move on. I'll, I'll, I'll write someone down. I'll write someone oh, down. Oh, okay. So this is a dual parted question. There are seven three twos that Forest were involved with this season, which I believe is a top flight record, uh, joint top flight record anyway. So the first part of this question is how many did we take the lead in at any point? Not whether we scored the first goal or anything like that. It's how many did we actually physically take the lead in that match? And the second one is, can you name all seven teams that we got a 3-2 result against or loss against? Because we didn't win any of them. But, <laughs> yeah, that is your question. Seven three-twos. Seven three it's embarrassing, isn't yeah, it, really? Seven Let's face it. Uh, Next season, we're going to go to four threes. <laughs> yeah. So, how many to take the lead in? And for uh, seven additional bonus points, can you name all seven teams that we lost three to against maybe next year we'll actually yeah. win one that'd be nice I've got five um, so, so seven yeah it's ridiculous yeah, seven. isn't it it's so ridiculous. bad yeah, uh, joint top fight record that um, one more I need who's that other team oh yes that one of course that one yeah is, it, 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 is this all competitions by the way no, just <laughs> just pram, just pram. Oh yeah, of course we did win a three to this season, didn't we? <laughs> the cup. Yeah. yeah. So just just pram, just pram. So seven, seven, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I forgot about Blackpool. I forgot about Blackpool. Yeah. What a great okay, right. day. Right. <laughs> well, yeah. Next question. And it's true or false? Harry Toffolo got more assists than Callum Hudson Odoi. Oh yeah. In all comps, just just the league. 
Okay. So again, true or false, Harry Toffolo got more assists and has uh, Callum Hudson a doy. All good? Yeah. Yeah. Reach it very deep before that. Yeah, I'm good, <laughs> mate. Yeah. Um, fourth question, please. Who was the most booked player in a Forest team this season in the league? That's another one of my questions, God. <laughs> God have, you done a back- have you done any backups? <laughs> um, yeah, I have got I a have, backup. But, yeah. um, I'll, got I'll book- probably have... Who got booked what, the most? One of my questions is similar to that, so I can keep it. So I need to just get rid of one. I'm putting one man and one man only on this. So I, can, I can quickly think of a question, I'm sure. I'll be shocked if it's not this yeah, person. Yeah. So, who was the most booked player in the Forest team this season? And probably bonus this point, person. you can guess how many they got. Oh, really? Uh, it's not going to be this person, but, you know, I'm putting them. Last question from me. According to the Premier League, how many official errors leading to goals did Matt Turner make this season? <laughs> 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 and to be fair, they have been very generous to him across the season. I will say. Oh, really? Very generous. I'm gonna. I think it's more, but I think it'll be this. Yeah, so again, just repeat. According to the Premier League, how many errors leading to goals did Matt Turner make? Okay, so race we'll start you. Seeing as Obviously, you know it. Uh, <laughs> actually, no, let's see Adam first. Penalty takers be Bristol City. So, who've you got now? Oh, Adam. God, this is going to be embarrassing because it's just like that game's like just a fog in my memory. Uh, I know one you scored the winning penalty. That is one, yeah. Uh, did did uh, Nico Williams take one? He did. Yes. Third one. Uh, Callum Hudson Adoy? The second one. Uh, did Mangala take one? Nope. Oh. Um, and then the other person I'll put Murillo. Nope, Murillo was on wow. the field at that point. No, oh, wow, three will do. So we've got Tyro, yeah, Tyro, Nico, Nia Carte, uh, Hudson, and yeah. Gibbs White. Oh, yeah, Nia yeah, Carte. I, did, I just thought, I just thought Gibbs White would have been off the field by then as well. Yeah, Nia Carte, Nia Carte would have lost, his memory would have lost with that. Then. Of course, he did, yes. yeah, yeah, because he yeah. missed one, didn't he? <laughs> he did. <laughs> Not to add, anyway. So, maximum of five points there. So, first part of the question um, about the three twos. How many games did we take the lead in when it came to the three twos this season? Six. Yes, yeah, six. Six is correct. So, one yeah. point if you got that. Can you yeah. name the seven teams we lost three two against? Yeah. West Ham, Brighton, yep. Newcastle, Bournemouth, yep. Chelsea, Brentford, Man United. Yeah, yep. I've got that. Yeah. <laughs> Newcastle was the only exception in which we didn't take the lead in. Yeah. We, we came back twice to draw, but yeah. And to be fair, thing. that game we so, could have took eight. the lead in if we'd got a pen out. Oh, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So that's so, that was an eight pointer. Eight, eight points. Eight points. So you can get a possible 13 so far. So if you're 14th yeah. point, Harry Toffolo, did he get more assists than Hudson or not? I'll True. Do he did. True. You're correct. Hudson yeah. Toffolo got in... three assists in the league this season. Hudson Doyle only got one, which is a little bit surprising. He got, he got two in one game right. against West Ham. Mm-hmm. Yes, he did. Yeah. And his other one was for um, Ola Aina. Go on, Ola. Okay. Oh, yeah. Spiller. That was a great goal. What a great goal. I sorry, Toffolo got one against... Um, um, it was his ball for Dominguez as well, against Brentford. Was it? Sure it was, yeah. yeah, it was. It was. It, it was, was. Yeah, yeah. you got it four. Was, yeah. You're doing them out of out of uh, out of stats. No, it's, it's, it's three on the stats, mate. So maybe one of the ones against West Ham isn't counted for him. Who knows? But um, oh, right. okay. And last, yeah. Uh, sorry, yeah. Part of question: uh, Who was the most booked player in the Forest team this season? So this is the fifteenth point. If you get the number right, it's sixteenth. So Adam, who did you put down? I've put I've put Ryan Yates because he fouls the most, but it's probably not him. With how many? No, nine. Nine's right. Is not it? Nine is right. Yeah, Gibbs no. White. I'll give you give you a point for that. <laughs> okay. Um, Gibbs White. Reece, yeah. Gibbs White with 
nine. Yeah, it's a little bit surprised. Really? Um, mm. Mind you, yeah. Yates smiles a lot at referees and gives him like gives him the eyes, doesn't it? A little fluttering. So that's probably why he gets away with it. So Yates did come second, so you were in the right ballpark. Yeah. So Yates, Sangare, and Mangala were all tied with six. <laughs> Sangare, who barely played, got loads oh. of buckets. It's actually unbelievable. Oh, yeah. And Wait till last next season, he's an absolute destroyer. destroyer. Of <laughs> the Premier League, then how many errors leading to goals did Matt Turner make? I'll go for three. I'll put three. Three is correct. Yeah. Yes. Again, Four marks. not entirely sure how it's Bloody only whip. three. But Bloody Wimbledon. I don't think they count <laughs> Bloody the Wimbledon. <laughs> I don't think they counted the Arsenal one. I don't think they counted the one where he pushed in against Brentford. Obviously, didn't count the foam incident. So, but yeah. Three. I got 14. Oh, being lobbed on his line. That was another turn of masterclass, that was. But, <laughs> yes. So, mm. 5, 13, Se- 14, 15, 16. That's 17. 17, you got that. You know, 31 out of 32. I'm happy with that. 14. Ooh. Should have chased well. out Darby. <laughs> I got 21 yeah. points. One for everyone that was uh, Title winning form, Matt. Three. But I'll move on to... Yeah. um. To mine, and let me just run down them to make sure we are kind of in order. Uh, obviously, because now nah, I've got to delete a few. Uh, uh, job, I can edit it. I can edit space out. I've, I've, <laughs> I've completely lost the plot on one answer. I don't know why I wrote that person down. <laughs> uh, I'll, just, I'll just be a minute. Yes, let's go. Right, so question one. How many games did we lose at home in the league this season? Oh, blimey. So how many games did we lose at home in the league this season? I think it's this. I think it's that, yeah. Come on, then. Question number two. How many times did we wear our away and third shirt in all competitions combined last season? So how many times did we wear our away and third shirt in all competitions combined last season? Not that many, which is is really annoying because I really liked it. This is both shirts. I don't think it's that many. Oh, both. Away and third, yeah. Away and third, okay. Away and no, third. I don't think we wore the third one that many times. I think it's we mostly wore red away. Even... Oh, I'm going to take a shot in the dark, that one. I have got a ballpark figure. Right, so this is a two-point question. Name either of the former Forest players to score passes in all competitions last season. So there's two. So name either, and if you do get both, you get two marks. Former Red who scored passes. Probably cursed them. I like that question. Yeah, I've got that. Got that. Yeah, got both? Yes. Yeah. Pretty sure I have, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Number four, which is one I've just quickly rammed in. In the famous picture of Felipe grabbing Bruno Fernandes Mm -hmm. around the throat, which Forest player is trying to intervene? (laughs) Um, blimey! I'm surprised they weren't it's trying to aid him. If my memory off, better. Um, so there's why one were... picture he's biting by the throat, and there's one forest player in between them both. Which why aren't, they tra- why aren't they just trying to help him? Like, <laughs> just, just do it for a favour. I don't I even know. He's on the pitch at that point, but the only person I can think it could be would be him. So yeah, I'm guessing. I'm glad I've got you thinking. That's the point of a quiz. I'm guessing. This next next one's a good one. Right, so number five. How many different scorers did we have this season in all competitions? And you can have a mark for every player you get that scored for us last season. All right, so write everyone down, basically. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Right. So how many different scores did we have this season, or, or last season, whatever you want to say, in all competitions? And there's a mark for each and every player that you get. Wowzers. So I'll give you a minute or so for that one, because, uh, yeah. Obviously I'm so sad, man. 
Mir- near Ka- uh, Murillo didn't score. Yeah, he doesn't count. He has to score an own goal. Yeah, we're not counting that. Scored a few in the wrong end, didn't he? Uh, he definitely did score one. Uh, I can't remember. I'll give you both until it says 26 on the recording. So you got just over a minute. Um, What's his name? Who else plays for us? This man. We scored quite... I, I, I've thoroughly thought we scored quite a lot of good goals as well this season. It's been nice. We scored a lot of good goals this season, yeah. Um, Who else plays football for our club? So many people. I think I've got them all. I think I've got most of them. Yeah. Uh, Would you want to move on? Okay. Yeah, I see the time now anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry if you can hear Gromit in the background. (laughs) Question (laughs) number six. Who scored our first cup goal of the season? Ooh, where did we get yeah, to in the league cup? I can't even remember. Oh, it's the league cup. Um, who scored our out? first cup goal of the season? Oh, Jordan. yeah, yeah, where did, is, yeah. Where did yeah. we go out? Who did we play? I can't even remember who we I'm played. Not telling, not telling you. I'm not giving you any answers. <laughs> I just forget like cup competitions. I couldn't care less half the time unless we start doing okay. That's not, that's not the actual time, is it? Yeah, yeah. Just Gen Z. Attitude. I am Gen Z. Um, <laughs> I couldn't even tell you we played. <laughs> Generally. I'm not going to tell you. We're Generally. moving on. Uh, yeah, move on. I can't remember. Question seven. Down. <laughs> Morgan Gibbs White made the most appearances for us in all competitions this season. Who was second on the list? How many questions you got, Reese? There's three more. Oof. Treating us. So obviously we've got the 20 questions. Make up the leaves. I'm stumping you on so I'm pleased. This was all done in McDonald's this morning, this was. <laughs> 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 Moving on, yeah? Yeah. Right, this one's probably the easiest to bunch, I'd say. So number eight, which player got our only red card of the season? Oh. Uh. So I'm surprised we only had one. I was a bit more disciplined this year, weren't we? Enjoyed it by being more disciplined. <laughs> Neil Warnock. Yeah. Um, God, who did? Wait, get no, we did. Red, we had more than one red card this season. Go on. We had at least two. I think we've had one. And this doesn't count the cops if no. there was one in the cops. No, I'm, I'm talking. I'm talking league because someone was sent off against Brentford. Someone was sent off against Bournemouth. Oh, yeah. there's another one somewhere. Yeah. Well. Oh, yeah, yeah. But who was it? Who was it against Brentford? And yeah, oh well, yeah, no, who it was against Brentford? Yeah. Forget that, Ben. I, I, bloody Wikipedia. <laughs> right, so that's free. So, <laughs> so name the red cards of the season. So it's two. three. Oh, there's three. Yeah, because I, I agree with Christian. There's obviously two there. Who else? Got... Oh, no. Wait. Who? I can't remember okay. now. Does someone get sent off like in the last minute of a game? Yeah, it, it, it's me reading it. It's me and just, reading it. And like, just, I just, I just, I just turned off. Yes. Yeah, so, 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 yeah. I'll oh, rephrase the question. So, there's oh. three red cards this season. So, which player's got the three red cards? Come and mark for each. I did believe in. I'll get some. I've got two. I can't remember the other one. What mistake I've made is I've I've read what were straight reds rather than two yellows. So the player yeah, I had yeah, in mind yeah. got a straight red, and then right. obviously there's two with two bookable offences. Okay. Question nine. <clears throat> Our famous tweet after the Everton game 
gained quite a lot of interest. Um, how many views on Twitter slash X did it get in the end? So I've got this is a multiple choice. So you've got 46 million, 48 million, or 50 million. Okay. I was going to say, is it close? Is it going to be to the closest million <laughs> before yeah. you gave uh, the multiple? I had a look, had a look at it earlier. So 46, 48, or 50. And then last question. Which one of our three goalkeepers kept the most clean sheets this season with a measly two? <laughs> That's in Brilliant. the Premier League, by the way. Brilliant. What a great what a great goalkeeper. So we've got four clean sheets in the Prem and one it of was our nice. kept two. It was nice to know that Dave Murphy really royally screwed up the Bruce Samba debacle and now look at him representing France in the Euros. Num number God. one as well. <coughs> Is he? Yeah. But I don't know whether... I, I think if mine then well, stay on yeah. start. Well, yeah, mine is 16. What a so, beautiful boy. Mm. Go on, Brees. Right, are we ready then? Yeah. So, number one, how many goals did yeah. we... How many, how many goals? How many games did we lose at home in the league this season? I've put 10. Wrong. Is it? I've put seven. Wrong. Nine. Five, so we won five, drew five, lost nine. Oh, bollocks. I've broke. Oh, I've just Thanks, swore as well. Man. I put nine and then crossed oh, it out. I and can't put believe any won five games in the league at home. That's, That's shocking. Really bad. Yeah. Okay. I put nine yeah. as well and then crossed it out. I put okay. 10. Number yeah. two. How many times did we wear out away and third shirts in all competitions? I'll let Christian go uh, first. I just guess 10. I put Wrong. 11. Wrong. 15. 15? Mm. 15. Where have you found this info? You had to go back for every game. Yeah, I, I remembered it in my mind. That was a long McDonald's trip. Mm. Okay, <laughs> so number three. Name <laughs> either of the former Forest players score past us in the all competitions last season. Yeah. Brereton and Jordan Gabriel. Correct. Yeah, oh, two points. I, yeah. Oh, I didn't, did he? I, had Ant I thought Antonio scored against us. It's West Ham. No, he didn't. No, Brereton and Jordan Gabriel. Last season, uh, Antonio scored. scored. That was fun. Thinking, number, yeah. number four, in the famous pick of Felipe grabbing Bruno around the throat, which Forest player is trying to intervene? Gibbs White. I've put... Wrong. I've put Nico Williams after crossing Correct. out. I'm a... Oh, really? I crossed Nico out. I'm about Medillo Murillo. I've got Nico because he was in like the right back position. I thought he'd be closest. <laughs> yes. Three. Okay. So, first of all, I'll get your guesses for this and then we'll take it in turns like some tennis to knock these players off. Okay. So, how many different scores do we have in all competitions? I've put 13. So, I got six. Wrong. Wrong. So, it's 15. Is it? Who have I missed out? Right. On? So let so start with you, Adam. Let's go. Let's go through them. Harry Toffolo. He's correct. Are you sure? Uh, Harry Toffolo scored against Wolves. No, no, no. Are Why? you sure? It's I've I've got sixteen names here. Well, let, let's go through them, and I'll tell. Point. I'll tell you. Go on, then, so Toffolo is correct. Wolves, yeah. Go on, Christian. You go. Uh, obviously, next. Wood. Yeah, of course. Various. Uh, Ryan Yates. Yeah, Sheffield United. Christian. Like, like tennis, Christian. Come oh, on. This, yeah. this is all comps, right? Yeah, all comps, yeah. Origi scored against Crystal City, didn't he? He did. Ah, yeah. that's yeah. what I forgot. That's what Correct. I forgot. Uh, Morgan Gibbs White. Correct. Christian. Uh, Hudson Doy. Correct. Andy O. Correct against Blackpool. Uh, Ola Aina. Villa, yeah. Yeah, I've got that. Uh, Nia Kate. Correct against Villa. Villa, correct. Yeah, that's it. Oh, I've got. No, I haven't. No. Oh wait, no. That's... Sorry. I think I've. I think what I've done is I've because the way I've got it on my phone, I can show you this to clarify this. Okay. I think I've counted the player twice by mistake. I might have fifteen. <laughs> um, okay. Go on. Yeah, then. I put Keep a comma off. Yeah. So um, the, the player I have down twice is Dominguez. Correct. Yeah, I've got Domingo. Five that's left. Now. I also have uh, a one year. I have Domingo. Correct. Four Alanga left. Alanga. Correct against Villa. Yeah. Uh, Alanga. Yeah. Serious. 
Two more. Uh, we said, and then I'm missing. Bolly. Who am I missing? Willy Bolly. Oh, oh, I forgot I'm Willy. Man, you and Chelsea, and we've got I've one com- more. Uh, Danilo. Uh, Danilo, correct. I completely yeah. forgot about Origi in the cup, pointless well, cup, Re- and uh, Willy Bolly, <laughs> my favourite player. Score the FA Cup, the pointless cup. No, Origi oh, in the. Oh, that was that was oh, FA okay. Cup, wasn't it? Yeah, it was yeah, pointless it was, at the time. Yeah. Bristol City, and it's boring. Yeah, I've got. Yeah, I've got 15 names then. I know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Right, this question next six. Question so who... I got... This is where I got caught out for the next question because, <laughs> yeah. as you can see question here, six, you scored screen. out first. If you can see that, the screen's very blurry. Mistake, mate, so I can't. I can't see. It doesn't. It's not that serious. <laughs> the screen's very saying, blurry, so I can't massive. see. Okay. Um, number six. Who scored our first cup goal of the season? Dominguez. I put. Dominguez. I put Nico Dominguez. Yeah, we did. League Cup was knocked out by Burnley 1-0. And yeah, Booney got that scored. was it. That was it, yeah. Shocker. Number seven, Morgan Gibbs-White made the most appearances for us in all competitions this season. Who was second on the list? I put Murillo. Wrong. I've got Is it? Mm. I'm going to check this because I've got Who a feeling it? you might be right. Ryan Yates. No, Ryan Yates got dropped a, a tonne. This season, I'm going to ch- check this. Uh, I have a feeling you might be right. Murillo got shouted at by, by a man from no, local. So from Mar- Murillo played 36 times. Yeah. Ryan Yates, 40, apparently. 40? Mm, in all competitions, this is, by the way. You're having a bubble bath. Uh, yeah. So I've, I've gone by um, minutes played. Murillo is second. Okay. Yeah, so all competitions. So... This says here, Mar- Marillo played 32 times in the Prem and four times in the FA Cup. So that's 36. And then didn't play. He wouldn't oh, play in the period. Yeah. Ryan yeah, Yates, um, 21 starts in the Prem, 14 sub appearances, four, four in the Cup, one in the Carabao Cup. Ugh. I'm sick. Sick in my mouth. <laughs> Right, number eight. Which so which players got our three red cards of the season? So who got the and straight what? red? Near Cate. It was near Cate, I guess. So. No. So well, near Cate, he sh- got two yellows. Near Cate. All oh, right. Bolly got two yellows. Correct. So who got the straight red? Warrell, yeah, Warrell. Warrell, yeah, correct. Warrell. Right, oh, against Man U, wasn't it? Completely yeah. Another then. stinking performance from that. Well, uh, number nine. Our famous tweet after the Everton game gained a lot of interest. How many views on Twitter did it get in the end? 46, 48 or 50 million? I went down the middle. 46, I think. 46 is correct. And Ugh. I literally made sure I didn't put my answer down the middle because that's people's analogies on things. <laughs> 46 million. If in and doubt, it, down the middle. Exactly. And in question 10, which one of our three goalkeepers kept the most clean sheets in the Premier League this season with a measly two? Matt Turner. Correct. <laughs> he also got one in the uh, FA Cup as well. Bristol City. I got 20 points if I'm counting each of those goal scorers. I, I'm, I've no idea what it's out of, to be honest. Well, I'm putting 20. So it looks yeah, good, so doesn't it? One, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six. Saying, is it one 20, for every red card, 20, by the way? 21, 22, yeah. 25, 26. Like, tw- I think it's out of 27, I think. I've got 20. I'm happy with that. I'll take it. I think I've got 22. Okay, that's good. Good. Right. We'll wrap up then with this um, this birthday spread. So people who's listens to talk sport on a Thursday afternoon. <laughs> um, so I'll basically explain it. So I've got 10 ex-Forest players. Well, some are at, one's actually still at the club, whose birthday is in June, which is coming up, which is obviously when the pod's being released. It's obviously my birthday as well, just to add that in there. So basically, you kind of go back and forth, like a bit of tennis kind of style. A margin of error occurs, and whoever's got the least on the last question goes first so obviously it gives the opportunity for the other person to try and knock down that margin of error so who wants to go first well whose birthday i think it is in june no so no who wants to go first answering 
Oh, when I name God. a player. All right. Two, I'll go first King. if you want. So, number one player on the list is Thiago Silva. So, what am I saying? Thiago so Silva. You, so, you need to guess his age. Oh, guess his age? What it, oh, right. what it will be this year. I think he'll be four. So, Thiago Silva, not the Chelsea. 30. Player. 30. Yeah. Christian. I go 31. It's different. Yeah. 31 is correct. Oh. Okay, oh. So you, you're obviously one out, Adam. Christian, yeah. you direct hit, so you're on zero. So your turn now, Christian. So question two. Uh, well, player number two, should I say, Brian Oyeda. Brian Oyeda. How old will he be this year? 25. Okay. Adam? I'll be 24. 24 is correct. Oh, go on. Ooh. So Level pegging. So, direct it again. So, 1-1 one, one after two. So, back to you, Adam. So, number f- player number three is Aaron Davis. Oh, yeah. Yeovil. Uh, yeah. I'm going to go... Um, so, he's he must be similar to Chris Cowan. So, I reckon f- 37 now. Christian? I was going to go for like 41. He's 40. Oh. So we're 40 this year. So, Christian, you're one out. So that um, means you're on to two. Adam, you're three out. So you're on to four. So, four, two. So, super. on to you now, Christian. Player number four, Mohamed Draga. <laughs> <laughs> 25th of June. How um, long will he be this year? Never played for us, did he? No. Going to match day squad of West Brom because I was there. You know he exists then. Oh, I told you it's a good little game. You guess you're thinking. I'm gonna go 32. 32. Uh, Adam. 27. He's 28. Yeah, I didn't what? think he was that old. Yeah. He's 28. Yeah. So Adam, you're that... one out on to yeah. five. Christian, you're four out, so you're on to six. So five, six after four. So back Go to you, Adam. So number five is Christian's favourite player, Matt Turner. 24th <laughs> of June. So how old will he be next month? Um, he's going to be the grand old age of 31. Christian? 30. I think 30, I'm wrong. 30 spot on. Is it? Oh. So we're halfway. We're at six each. Ooh. So... That's, so... Number six is another goalkeeper, and he's actually got the same birthday as me, Ethan Horvath. <laughs> Ethan Horvath, 9th oh. of June. So, Christian, this is you first. I think about maybe 28. 28, Adam. I think it's 29 this year. He's 29 this year, correct. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, six, so, six to Adam, seven to Christian. This is a great um, battle. It's always it's a good little game. So next question is someone else who's also on our books at the minute still is Loic Mbe So. Is he on our books? I believe so, yeah. Loic Mbe So. How old will he be this year? So is it's it... to you, Adam. Uh 24. 24. Christian. I'll go to 23. 23 is correct. Oh. So we're back to <laughs> at seven. It's seven all. <laughs> oh. Question number eight. Eight or well, player number eight, should I say Gary Gardner? Oh, so Gary, wow! Oh, Gary God. Gardner is Harold he still playing? Be... Is he selective? He is, he is, Which yeah. of the Birmingham clubs is he playing for these days? Solly or Wall? <laughs> still at Birmingham, isn't he? I think I'm not sure. Yeah, he's um, still there, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna yeah. say he is 33. Okay, I'm Christian. 32. 32 is correct. What? So, Adam, you're on to eight. Christian, you're on seven. So, two plays to go. So, the next one is another successful loanee, Rafa Mia. Oh, yeah, he's having a great June. So, so, Adam, it's you first. Great How player. How will Rafa Mia be this year? Uh, I reckon he'll be 30 this year. 30. Christian? I'm going to go 28. He's 27. Oh. oh, that means you're three out, Adam, onto 11. Christian, you're one out, onto eight. So you, this means you go first, Christian. 
for the last player. Okay. So you've got a margin of three at the minute trying to overcome Adam. So this player it's is probably like, the hardest yeah, on the list. It's playoff all over this, isn't it? This is my um, friend from Bath, Dean Saunders. <laughs> Dean I thought he was going to say Kyle Eversilio. Yeah, 21st of June. <laughs> so our old is Dean Saunders. Where are we going to be this year? Oh, wow. Oh, Christ. I'm going go like 51. 51, okay. So Adam, you need to basically go to win either 47 yeah. or 55. Well, I think he's 56. Okay, and you'd be correct because he's 60. Oh, go on. So, so that means you win, Adam. Go on, the boy. Nah, this yeah. should be a, we could do this as a monthly quiz. This is great. <laughs> it's, it's, it's good. <laughs> so the, 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 basically, the talk sport one, Andy Jacobs does a gag, which I'm not doing. And they also have um, the backing vocals of Sergio Mendes and Pele. All right. Um, so, yeah. So that's it, yeah. Brilliant. What a great way to end the football year <laughs> as such with a... Bring, quiz. On, uh, bring on the Euros. Definitely. Um, yeah, no, yeah, guys, if you've enjoyed the quiz, obviously drop us what your view scores you got in onto the comments and everything. Um, we look forward to the charity game. I'm sure we'll probably talk about that at some point during the, the summer. But yeah, enjoy the enjoy the Euros. Um, enjoy the palaver that is Forest throughout the transfer window. I'm sure there'll be plenty to talk about, plenty, plenty of ingo ingoings and outgoings and everything else. Um, hopefully not too crazy. Like we'd like a bit of a quieter summer, uh, but we know it's not going to happen. But uh, Reese Christian, uh, look forward to seeing you at the weekend. Um, for now, guys, enjoy this one. Take care and come on, you Reds. This podcast is proud to be part of the Talk Sport Fan Network. Talk Sport, powered by fans.